Hey everybody, I'm just driving from the hospital over to the shopping center to pick up some breakfast. Uh, Danielle finally got moved out of the ICU after six days into the um, acute care unit. So they are seeing some progress. They did not have to tap her. In case you don't know, um, if you haven't read in comments lately, she had a uh, effusion around her heart, which means that fluid is around her heart. Her body overreacted to her surgery. And um, so, sorry, I look so tired because until last night when our son came up from college, we've been spending every night at the, ho at the hospital and one of us has been staying at the hotel. And the problem is that um, in the ICU, you're not allowed to sleep. You can sit in a chair all night with your kid, but you can't sleep at all. So you know, maybe you could sneak out for like an hour over to the, um, to like a little, little, I guess, sofa-ish things that they have, you know, in the lobby and kind of try to sleep on there. But, you know, anyway, so it's been rather exhausting. But um, anyhow, just wanted to let you all know what was going on with her. Uh, she's in good spirits and everything. It's obviously been very tough on her it hurts really 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 badly she's been on like morphine and dilated and all this stuff but we're seeing progress so hopefully um, we can come home in the next few days so just wanted to give you all a little update so thanks and um, hope you guys are having a good weekend